In the next year, this ship will use over 28,000 tonnes of fuel, valued at $14 million. But now, there is a simple, cost-effective way to reduce this by an average of 2,800 tonnes, saving over $1.2 million per year. Extensive testing by the US and UK Navy has found that fouling of a ship's hull, that is the build-up of algae and other marine growth, can increase fuel consumption by 40% in order to maintain a vessel's design speed and draft. This not only adds to the running costs, but also increases greenhouse gas emissions. Traditional hull cleaning technology, such as abrasive brushes, has been banned in most parts of the world. The challenge to develop new technology to remove fouling from ships' hulls was taken up by Commercial Diving Services Australia over five years ago. This undertaking has led to a new cost-effective way of treating the hull using thermal shock. This hull surface treatment technology, or HST, kills the marine growth instantly. But the dead growth does not fall off until the ship is in open water, being washed off through the propulsion of the ship. Contaminating a harbour or port with marine growth from foreign areas has been a major environmental issue with previous methods of defouling a ship's hull. Abrasive methods also remove anti-fouling paint, increasing the damage to the local environment. Independent tests have found that HST's thermal shock completely kills the treated growth on the hull and has no detrimental effects on the anti-foul coating or the surrounding water. Captain Peter Sinclair has extensive experience in the Australian Navy and has found the HST technology to deliver significant cost-saving benefits. Hull surface treatment technology is the first hull cleaning technology that I have seen in my 30 years that actually works. And if the treatment is conducted periodically, will keep the hulls of your ship clean, thus providing you with greater fuel efficiency allowing an increase in speed with a reduction in fuel and is much better for the environment. The system is highly portable and is applied to ships without the use of divers. The entire application is controlled from the surface, eliminating the need for divers and their expensive support systems. The HST's thermal applicator attaches to the hull via a unique and complex system of magnets. Its flexibility means it can move down to the lower part of the curve just above the flat bottom of the hull, so ensuring a thorough treatment. The soft rollers stop the powerful magnets from touching the hull, eliminating any chance of removing paint or growth and preventing any discharge into the local ecosystem. Seawater heated to approximately 70 degrees is infused over each hull section for about 20 seconds and is contained by a custom-designed soft seal that follows the contours of the hull. The hot water can be generated aboard the ship or in a small boat next to the ship in a temperature-controlled boiler. The treatment of the hull is designed to deal with the marine growth before it advances beyond the infant stage. This requires about two treatments each year. The fouling on this ship, the Torrens, was treated using the HST technology. Four and a half months later, it was put into dry dock, which gave the opportunity to assess the effectiveness of the treatment. The marine growth, which had been killed instantly, had been washed off in the open ocean through the normal operation of the ship. The treatment results in dramatic savings in fuel consumption. This means a ship with an average fuel consumption of 100 tonnes per day and sailing 266 days in the year would save over $1.3 million a year whilst maintaining normal operational speed if fuel prices were $500 a tonne. HST also reduces the need for more costly dry docking required to remove marine growth from the hull. The benefits to the bottom line, as well as reducing carbon emissions, mean the HST system is a win-win for ship owners around the world. The contribution made by HST has been recognised through numerous awards, such as first prize in the Lloyd's List Asia Awards 2009 for environmental innovation. 
The panel of judges at the Sea Trade Asia Awards agreed that HST ranked in the top five emerging technologies in maritime environmental protection. HST's groundbreaking and unique technology has led to global patent protection. This year, HST will save a ship of this size over $1 million and reduce its carbon emissions by 8,000 tonnes. For international inquiries relating to HST technology, please contact Keith Johnson or Tim Johnson at Commercial Diving Services Australia on 612-4261-4200 or email info at commercialdiving.com.au. For Australian inquiries, please contact Chris Geeter at TNC Marine, a division of Thomas & Coffee Limited, on 02 4200 5200 or email cgeeter at thomascoffee.com.au.